Hello again there, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome back to Foundation, where a big O storm is about to strike. We have news of bad weather coming our way, so hopefully we have enough storm... We uh, sorry, enough food to weather the storm. Bad weather on its way, but so are all the likes, because you all love to see this game and are excited to see more. Make sure you follow me on Twitter, by the way, where if I get extra keys to this game, that's where I'm going to give them away. So if you too like Foundation and would like to give it a try... That's the greatest way to do it. So check down below in the description and say hi on Twitter and follow me there. All right, we've got a lot of things to do in order to complete the bakery. There seems to be some sort of a glitch. I've reloaded the game and everything, and it seems like uh, stone is being delivered, but planks are still having a problem. So I'm trying to uh, make sure that we don't have any more uh, problems with planks by essentially making more. And then we'll take that out of the trade list, too, and see if that actually solves it. So thanks, everybody, for all your suggestions and everything like that. I do get a chance on occasion to be able to read some of your comments and suggestions. Some of them good and some are shots in the dark, just like my guesses on some things too. You can't always be right when it comes to foundation because there's a lot of uh, things that are unknown. Of course, this is uh, uncharted territory for us to go into this storm, so I don't know if we're supposed to have a thousand bread or if seven can do it. We'll see if it's uh, good enough to move on forward. So welcome back everybody. Good to see you all here. We're now preparing to uh, man the battle stations with the uh, bakery as soon as we can. And it looks like the woodcutters have completed all their job. Excellent. So now we can go ahead and probably get rid of a few of them and do some other jobs. Well, let's go ahead and extract everything around the f uh, church here first. There we go. And the woodcutters cont continue on doing their thing. Fantastic. All right, very good. Oh, it looks like we got a request from the king. We still can't get that bakery up, so I'm going to keep it all for now. We're trying to get that bakery up. If I build it somewhere else, I don't know if the problem's going to fix itself or not. But we will see shortly. We just need to finish up the sawmill and produce some more planks. Looks like we have 50 planks in total. So there should be no question that the planks should be able to be built. I'm going to put the bakery elsewhere then and see if we can put it in a new spot. So let's try if we if we can put it somewhere else. If it functions, that'll be great. And we should have the gold for it very soon. We'll see if we can tuck it in somewhere else. Maybe it's just too close to other things. There needs to be several entry points to it. But they were delivering some goods, which leads me to believe that the issue is somewhere else or something else for trial and error. All right, let's go ahead and try putting it uh, maybe closer to the uh, maybe closer to the farms. Maybe somewhere over here, for example. Just to see if we can try to uh, remedy the situation and keep all the stuff close. Maybe we'll produce flour over here. The closer to the farm fields, maybe the better. But bread will still have to be transported into the city. So we'll give that a shot as soon as we have enough gold. Uh, we've reduced some of our construction materials now. Looks like houses are being completed by our construction teams as more people are moving in. There's also a lack of food because of all the uh, berries that I turned off. So let's get that back up and running. Sign a couple of villagers here to work. There we go. That was my bad for turning that off. And now we can start selling all of our bread again. Happiness should go back up. I had that turned off for a trade deal that you saw completed at the start of the episode. And it explains why our money was tanking. There we go. All right, so let's get this bakery down as soon as we got enough cash. I'll try to tuck it in over here. And uh seems to be a glitch whenever they try to deliver planks for whatever reason. But now we've got over 59 planks. Only 20 are needed, so hopefully they can deliver all the goods. Let's go ahead and make that high priority now, as well as the other uh, sawmill. We'll hopefully see that come to a completion. I built a nice little area over here for some more homes, but apparently uh, we're going to have to move it. So sometimes you got to work within the game's limitations. And uh, since this recent update came out, and since the game's not completed, always take issues with the grain of salt because they can always be updated quickly by the developers. All right, looks like uh, farming is taking place again. They're planting all the wonderful crops. I wonder if they can fill up the whole area or how, how big the area of influence is for the farm fields. Looks like they, they can do quite a bit of fields, just not as big as I'd hoped. Maybe, we'll see. Give them that whole area and we'll see how much they can actually produce. Looks like this one over here has filled up all of its space, so we'll try to paint some more crop fields for them. Maybe over here. Something like that. Maybe we'll get closer to the trees. Alright, a big storm is coming. Ooh. I don't know if I heard it. We'll see what happens. Okay, we got a few people working there. Oh, it looks like the planks have been delivered now. Okay. But is there going to be a problem with the stone this time? Maybe it was locational. Well, if that's the case, let's make sure we're storing uh, wheat and flour over here. And then we only want to store bread there, inside of town. Let's go ahead and empty our stock of flour. 
And let's see if this bakery actually gets completed. Now what we don't want to see is the name flashing. Looks like the loggers are having some trouble finding some wood. That's okay, we'll buy some expansion. Actually, we could do that at any moment, really. I think we should expand to the other side here, so that way we can get the iron. And we can also expand up here to turn that area into a new logging camp. So let's do that. We'll go log some new area. There you go, folks. Oh, looks like there's some iron up there. I hadn't spotted it. But I, didn't, I wouldn't want to build just one. Having multiple is a good idea. So we can build two at once. So let's build both of those. Additionally, we'll have to start burning charcoal and making all that so we can do that nearby. Actually, let's take a look back at that uh, bakery again. All right, in terms of uh, stone, it looks like we've got a few people working there. The problem about the stone cutter camp is that we only have a little bit of stone. And let's see if we can mine some more stone, maybe. Looks like there's no real stone around, except for if we go across the river. We only have that one little pile, and it seems to glitch out. Sometimes that... If they try to build on the opposite side, or rather mine on the opposite side, it doesn't let them. All right, my lord, as predicted, the sky is falling. I hope we've gathered enough food to sir, live through the period. Uh, yields of berry and wheat are and blank are decreased by 90%. Yields of blank are increased by 50%. I don't, I don't know what that means. But okay, let's see the storm approach. Wow, this is epic. This is the first time we get to see it. The storm update is here. Let's see what happens. Does it affect the weather? Let's see. It doesn't seem to change yet. I hope the appearance changes. Alright, 20 tools have been delivered. Looks like it actually was a positional thing, so we moved it. It's doing a little bit better. Maybe, the, maybe it was the fence. This game is very picky about those types of things. It's a shame, because you try to get all close together with things, and sometimes it just doesn't like, like your plan. But it's all good. Most things are trial and error. Alright. So those of you who predicted uh, that as being a problem in the other episodes, you may be right. It's hard to tell sometimes with this game. What might be right and wrong. Two more villagers arriving. Everybody's at hard at work, aren't they? Make another decorative tree. All right, sheep farms are getting completed. Good. Perfect. We'll make some uh, weavers and such over there. All right, well, apparently the storm is here, but I don't... It must just be a statistical thing and not like a graphical thing. However... There could be a violent storm. Maybe we're missing out on something. All right, that bakery's got to get done. But the only thing that's slowing me down now is stone production. So if we could buy another territory, that would be wonderful. Uh, I don't think I have any more free ones that I could purchase. Up here would be great, though. That would fix all of our stone problems. So that will be good. That'll be a future move for us to increase stone production. And let's see what else we can do. Cutting down the forest there will allow us to build more homes. Perfect. Gives us a lot of space up there. How is the church doing on attendance? 26 out of 100. Very good. And the bakery is nearing completion. We just need some more stone to be delivered. A lot of it's being turned into polished stone for trade. So we are trying to sell as much of that as possible. It is bringing in some cash. That's a very valuable thing for us, as well as wine, which is something I do frequently. I'm sure your children do, too. All right, 6 out of 20. Good. Let's go ahead and get ourselves some more homes up here. As soon as that land is clear, it'll be perfect. And we'll eventually occupy that uh, iron mine over there. Okay, happiness is at 86%. Things are improving. Man, come on now with that bakery. It's just the production of stone that's the major problem. Plus, I've had to rebuild that building a couple of times to get around whatever issue was here. I try to make things look pretty, but sometimes it causes more of an issue. Like, for example, when the fence were here, 
and here. Apparently that blocked the doors. No possible way those people could walk through. <laughs> they must have a much bigger hitbox than it appears. So that's understandable. Let's build ourselves a weaver's hut over here. And then eventually a tailor. Let's see. Alright, weaver's hut is down. We'll work on the tailor next. As soon as it's built. And how are we doing on the windmill? Looks like they produce quite a bit of flour. Excellent. Lots of flour being brought in here. Let's go ahead and store more and more flour. So it looks like the crop eventually does die and wither. That is a thing that could happen now in the recent update too. So as soon as the uh, bakery is done, a lot of that flour will start going to use year-round. Jeez, it takes a long time for that stuff to get delivered, doesn't it? Right, the weaver is going up. We're back on track, everybody. Let's hear it for Raptoria. Glory to Raptoria has got to be the only thing that buries the top section of all those wonderful comments. So make sure you help your fellow Raptorians crawl to the top. There's going to be defeatists and depletists who think everything is zero and woe and trite, but we have to keep on fighting and doing our best in order to make a better society. Just like in real life. Can't give up now. Well, it looks like berries are starting to run out, but bread should be uh, actually... Do we? Oh. We should be able to make bread sh uh, shortly. Oh, actually, to be honest, we've got so much flour in storage. Ooh, there's so much flour in storage, we could build another bakery. I want to actually build one back here. I tried to tuck it into the corner, but if I put it maybe over here, though everything seems to have a bigger hitbox than it actually appears, if I could tuck one in over there, next to the well, we could double our bread production, increase our income, and then also... Well, let's actually make sure we've selling a lot of bread. Let's do another one of those. Uh, who do we want to help? Let's see. I'm going to have to keep it all, King. We are we are out. We are during a drought right now. We're going to have to keep it all, my liege, in order to get our people some food. Alright, berries are out during this trying time. Have faith. That bakery is almost done. More deadly than the uh, weather and stuff in these games can be little glitches like that. I've encountered millions. Sometimes it's about how you kind of get around little things like that, like how we got around our uh, wooden bridge fiasco last time and all this other stuff. So you just, you just roll with the punches and try to do better the next time. That's all life is. All right, Grace is the sign of the uh, construction there. Oh, we need to uh, deploy troops. Absolutely. We'll go out on a mission for you. Oh, good. The berries are back. The storm must, have, uh, must be over now. All right, let's get those uh, crops back up. We were running out there. So now we can come back with a vengeance. We can come back with a huge supply of bread. Just a few more stone needs to be produced. 23 stone there. Let's go ahead and get rid of the uh, person at the stonemason hut. Let's just take regular stone now for a little bit. So uh, some of these other buildings can be produced. Looks like a lot of buildings are taking regular stone, so let's make sure we're not polishing anymore. Too bad they can't take both. It'd be nice if they could. You know what would be really nice is if uh, a building took 20 stone, but if you were making polished stone, it took like 5. That would be really cool. All right, money has plummeted as, of course, the market is suffering because of the severe lack of food. Fix your market, YouTuber! Thank you, Billy. F whoa, fantastic. Just, all you gotta do is just, just, homeless, just buy a house. That's all you gotta do. Oh, well, wonderful, Billy. Problem solved. Wow. We gotta get you to address Congress. Alright, the bakery is done. Let's go ahead and assign some people immediately to start making bread. Beautiful. Then we'll get the uh, granary to make sure it picks up bread as well. Excellent. And let's go ahead and make this pick up more berries. Extra berry storage. Very important. And let's finally make sure we've got somebody selling bread. Two people selling bread. Excellent. We'll get to close next. That won't be as big of an issue. Alright, we need to get some more windmills going. But unfortunately, we're out of cash. Oh, look at all that. Yes, perfect. F all that flour delivered. Beautiful. All right, the money that we get once our economy economy's back on track, because all we have right now is food, so that's really why it's tanked, is because we're really not producing much else aside from food. So there's not much for us to trade right now. We're just trying to feed our own people. But once we're back on track, we'll be able to make clothes, which should bring some big cash, and then, of course, our soldiers will provide us with $1,000. So that'll be back on tr uh, track, too. Oh, perfect. The amount of bread. Excellent. All right, folks. Lots of bread. Come on over. 
Berries weren't doing so well, but let's see. Oh, look at that. Three bread for 36. Look at how much that sells. Beautiful money. Here it comes. We're back on track, everybody. Glory to Raptoria. Absolutely. Absolutely. We're going to do it. I need to buy the territory over here just to get those stone cutters to quit crying. The developer needs to move that to another place in the map so that way there can be five people on that. I've seen them work five before, unless it's a recent update or something. Perfect. More. F wow, look at... Oh, I didn't realize the granary actually stacked up boxes outside. I thought it all went inside. That kind of looks messy. All right, just watch yourselves, folks. You might have to leap over the boxes. Ah, look at all that flour. Dude, we can build so many bakeries now. That is, no joke, awesome. Unfortunately, I don't have a well here, and I don't think I can build one. Oh, I can. I'll just build one right here, then. Well, that one's going to be specifically for the baker. We need to build another bakery up here. Soldiers are back from a mission that's going to give us some cash. Let's put everybody else into... What, what do we have for unemployed? We got quite a few unemployed, actually. A few people are purposely being unemployed. So that way we can kind of adjust things. Perfect. The amount of cash that just came in got us back on track. Glory to Raptoria. That happiness is going to go back up, too, as we're making more bread. And that money is going to come in so we can make another bakery. This is it. We are out of the hot water now. More like uh, out of the frying pan and into the fire, but that's okay. We can also sell our wine for additional cash, too. All right. 214. Oh, yeah, this is it. Look at this town expand. That's crazy, the amount of homes that just popped up there. I'm glad we actually built over there, because over here we weren't going to have a lot of room. Over here, there's plenty of room for everybody to live, and then even more. Eventually, we'll move our military base over here, and we'll put it on the coast. Maybe we can make it look like it has a navy or something like that. Would that be a cool idea? If we get enough likes, I could probably, like, redesign everything. If you guys want to see a navy, let me know. Get her up well past 1,000 likes, and I could take a whole episode to do the navy if you want to. Now, there's no ships or anything like that, but we could still make it look cool. And, of course, just because there's a naval base with no ships doesn't mean we don't have a fleet. So we can kind of pretend if we want to. All right, the well is completed, so that means more production on the bread without them having to walk all the way up here to go to the well, which is probably right there where they're getting it. Jeez, I'm so excited to build this bakery, but nobody's here yet. Wow, look at that baker go. Is she just, like, beating that? What is she doing? Do you guys see that? She's just beating the bread with a stick. Wow. That is... Ma'am, could you come back and do that again? I wanted to see what was going on there. Ma'am? Or sir? Somebody. That was sheer craziness. Alright, let's make sure we're still selling things. What are we selling to the neighbors? I don't know if we're out of the time of drought. We probably would have more cash if berries were selling better. Trading resources. Let's make sure we're trading planks, too. Which we are. Anything over 35. Berries we're not selling. That's important. We'll hold on to that. All right, now's the time where we're really trying to grow, but we're being held back by cash. I think the less soldiers that you send on a mission, too the less likely it is to succeed. So with the maximum of five, I think it's a guaranteed victory every time so long as you pay for the quest. Or at least pay for it in terms of manpower. All right, there's a ton of... Uh, look at that. Wow, that is the way bread is made. I had no idea. You just beat it with a giant paddle. That's, that's interesting. Wow, it's very interesting. All right, with the second bakery down, we should be able to double bread production. We should increase money. And how are we doing on food? Or, I mean, uh... Ooh, yeah, look at that. Almost over 200 flour. And they produce, like, what, six at a time? Yeah. Like six flour is taken at a time for that? Crazy. All right, let's make sure we're selling good items here. Are we selling logs? Let's go ahead and make sure we're selling logs. Let's make sure we're selling planks. Let's sell those. Let's sell wine, good. We sell flour? Let's, let's sell some flour. Everything above 150. Alright. 
I don't know if anyone will buy that, but we'll see. I don't know if anybody's actually in the market for that. The resources may change. I don't see anybody actually buying it, but there's a possibility that the market requirements could change, and we'll see it all uh, change up here. Workplace is full, woodcutter. Okay, so we got uh, a need for another market, essentially, but we don't have the cash for it. I just want another baker to get our economy back on track. The way we're going to make the most amount of money now is by selling food and uh, also getting the weaver back up and running. Actually, the weaver's making textiles. Oh, just need to get that assigned. Probably we'll get some sheep going there. So we can wall this off. We'll have to make a um, tailor before we actually make any sort of money from that. But bread is the most important thing, so... I guess because of our earlier bakery fiasco where I had to move it, that's really what set me behind. But we have little faith. Let's continue on, rolling forward. We've made many a successful nation. All you gotta do, YouTuber, is just do the thing. Oh, perfect. Thank you, Bill. Billy. Wow. Big. Big brain Billy here with the, with the knowledge drops here, like Albert Einstein just slopping right through. That is awesome. All right, problem right now is mostly food, yeah. Uh, I, is this the drought is still going on? I think, or the the big weather change? Maybe maybe this is a drought instead. Maybe the storm is. I maybe I <laughs> maybe I under uh, oversold it last time. Maybe there's different weather effects that came in. But from what I've seen in the screenshots, it's like tremendous rains and lightning and things like that. So maybe that's yet to come. All right, let's make sure everybody's doing their thing. Takes a little time, but we're getting there. At least food is coming in. We just need more bakers to provide food. It looks like berries are actually trickling in. I just need cash. It seems like uh, we can build uh, different things. Like, we can build decorations, no problem. But when it comes to a true building, it's like a no-can-do. If I could get some sort of a loan... Anybody in chat want to click or tap the join button, by the way? Become a member today? I'm going to need about $300, guys. I am desperate. I need, I need, this, uh, I need this bakery. Actually, we can assist the king. Oh, we actually get coin for doing that. Good. Uh, who could we help out? Uh, who should we help out? Let's see. Oh, probably the clergy. They're the lowest number. So let's help them out. Uh, well, that gave me a little bit of money. So we had enough bread and storage. Any, anything else I can unlock? No, we gotta get to a higher level. Still waiting on this bakery. The Great British Bake Off. It's more of a standoff, really. Oh, come on now. Negative 58? Ugh. Oh, well. We just need to wait. It's, the game doesn't want me to do it. As soon as that bakery is down, trust me, the amount of bread we're going to sell to our people is going to... The happiness will skyrocket, and so will the money. It's trying to hold me back from success. You don't do it. Don't you do it. Oh, of course, we still got to build it as well. Hopefully, we don't run into any more trouble with the uh, areas of construction being blocked. I wonder if we should do it that way. No, I like it this way. This seems like the nicer way to put it. Of course, if our soldiers go on another quest, we would be okay. Seems like everything's just taking my cash. We also have a lot of unemployed, but really no jobs for them to take. All right, well, the money's not coming in like I'm hoping. So let's make sure we've got every job fulfilled then. Except for the, uh... Yeah, we don't need that to be fulfilled over there. Is there anybody I can sell? Did they take wool? Seems like this playthrough, I'm not able to sell a lot of basic stuff. It's going to be more later game stuff. So, like, for example, um, these guys will buy bread eventually if I provide 20 clothes. But even if we were to build the tailor, that's going to take some time, too. So let's try, let's try the tailor. It's only 50, but it will take time to get that up. So let's try it. So we should have some stuff stored up. Should be some wool in, in storage somewhere. Or maybe not, actually, because we don't have a warehouse there. There's just, like, 50 fabrics sitting there. But then eventually we can make clothes and then open it up for trade. So let's get rid of the item we don't need anymore, which is probably the polished stone. And let's go for clothing, then. Perfect. Oh, we can sell that for a much higher price. So these people are not buying planks. So they're only really buying... Well... The only thing I can do is unlock the trade route. Then we have to switch it to bread. So that'll solve some of our money woes. This one's a little different than the previous ones. They may have updated that. Looks like money is coming in, though, from bread being sold and food, too. Come on, now. 
Somebody buy some more bread. We need a delivery. All right, good. This is going up. All right, I guess we're doing other things to make money. <laughs> right back down to zero. As soon as we got close. Unfortunately, or rather fortunately, it looks like nobody's leaving too to unhappiness yet. Last time they were very picky. This time they're just holding on. The Raptorians are here to stay. Glory to Raptoria. We got it. All right, so this is going to go up. The tailor's going to make some clothes then. And then we can start those exports. Luckily, we're making plenty of planks for future construction projects. We could start construction on a large bridge. But I think we should buy this territory up here and make it a stone bridge rather than wasting the materials and time. And that'll also save us money on the tools, too. Looks like we have four bread and storage there. It's immediately being uh, bought. All right, now we have people leaving, finally. I don't know if this storm has passed yet. I think it's still here. That's another thing, too. Keep reminding yourself that the storm is here, so production apparently is slower. Uh, at least for berries, but the the weed is hanging on. The, the, the flower is absolutely abundant. So we do have the chance to build that bakery. Finally, clothes can be made. Good. All right, project completed. Make sure everybody's assigned one out of one. One out of one, good. All right. Excellent. Now what we got to do is just wait for that cash to come in. Hopefully we get a mission from the king. That'll bring us up to uh, the amount of money that we need. Or another quest for more bread. Come on, people. Hold it. Hold on now. We got four clothes to unlock. I wonder if we could start selling clothes to our people, too. Let's try that. That could make us some more money. Let's try that. Okay, we may have gotten out of this debacle. Stay with me. Power of positivity. We can do it. Come on now. 142. Money should still continue to go up. When we hit 20, we can unlock a new trade route, which we just did. Boom. Fantastic. New trade route unlocked. Excellent. All right, let's start storing uh, clothes here. Who's our next neighbor? All right, these guys are buying red tools, uh, leather, and weapons. All right, very good. Let's go ahead and sell some of our... Uh, what are they buying again? Bread, right. So for bread, let's sell everything over, let's say, 50. So when we hit that, we can start trading with them. So this is actually making it a tough start because we are not able to trade a lot of the basics, like wool and clothes and things like that. But that'll make for an easier late game because then we can start trading some really expensive stuff. It might be different each time. So keep in mind, glass, honey, tools, barrels, these are all late game stuff, except for the fish. That's probably the only early thing that we've got. Actually, we can unlock this trade route for 20 bread. So they'll actually buy some clothes. Perfect. All right, money should be back on track now. Storm completely hasn't blown over yet. Come on, bakery. Come on, baby. Yes, we can do it. Come on. Popper right there for me. All right, hopefully somebody can build that thing. Come on now. Get to it. Let's make that a high priority. Come on over, everybody. Okay, this is it. So the big drought, I guess. The big... I guess it's a weather change of some sort. Now, if our soldiers go out on a quest, we should be good. Is clothing being purchased? Uh, we should have somebody working that. Yes, we do. Clothing is being purchased. Excellent. Completed the house. Come on, let's get that happiness up. We got 12. Oh, perfect. That's going up. Perfect. Food is coming in. Excellent. There we go. More and more berries. Very good. Very fantastic. Very nice. Oh, man, this is it. They can't stop us now. All right, if we build another warehouse, we should be able to hold some more of that stuff over here in the industrial sector. We'll build our military camp out there. And we'll build more of the sheep up that way. We can always scoot them to make more space. Let's go ahead and put the wool and other things here. Should be able to trade from there, too. So I think we just need to make some more weavers. Oh, wow, look at the amount of clothing that we're making. That is crazy. And perfect. The king has asked us to go out on a mission. This is it. Finally, everything's starting to link up. All right, we should be able to bring in a thousand coin. 
Now we should be able to bring in another weaver's hut. No, we want to bring in another uh, tailor's workshop. There you go. And if we can place another one of these down, we should place it this way. And actually can use more of that fabric. I'll scoot those around, make those different directions too, so they look good. Uh, all right, our soldiers are out. They're, they're being sent out on their mission. Excellent. Still not making enough bread. Oh, finally. Looks like things are going. It was just the position of the building. It gets a little weird when things get tight. 42, 82, 72. Excellent. That windmill is kicking butt. How much flour or wheat is there? 39. Okay, we could probably build another flour mill now. All right, a big setback with the bakery being broken before. But now it's actually on track. Please let it be built. We have the 20 tools needed. We have lots of clothing. We just need 20 bread to unlock a new trade route. Let's see if we can actually manage that. Okay, we seem to have just a few amount, a little bit of bread. we got to crawl out now. Oh, and look at the money coming in. That money, though. Awesome. Let me build another... Uh, Taylor's workshop, please. Let's bring in some more clothing. Put a few businesses over here. Keep everything in this area over there. Perfect. The warehouse is ready. Almost ready. Just a builder needs to be free. We'll get some more people assigned to that. Oh man, the weaver has produced a ton. He's just waiting for wool. And that just needs to be transported. So we'll have wool and fabric and finished clothes here. Big, big time. We got it. That money's coming in. Yeah. Fantastic. Just need some more bread. Bakery's almost done. There we go. Get to it. And then they can use that well as as well. Fantastic. Hopefully they can make it there. All right, well, I didn't get the bakery in the position I wanted, but it's down finally. So a good round of applause for that one. Absolutely astounding. All right. We got a ton of unemployment. We got to get going on that one. Building completed bakery, building completed warehouse. Get you guys to pick up some wool, please. Pick up some fabric. And pick up some clothing for additional trade. Alright, let's assist. Uh, we'll go for the clergy some more. That seems to be a lower number. So we just need to produce five bread. That's a pretty easy uh, obtainable goal. As soon as we have the extra. Okay, we got people working there. Uh, how do I close this menu? There we are. Alright, five bread needs to be supplied. We just need extras. So as soon as we got five bread there. Oh, we almost had it. Soldiers are back from a mission. A huge income boost is coming our way. I think we need more bakeries, to be honest. Yeah, one windmill is more than enough. The bakeries can be built all over the, the kingdom, to be honest. Let's see. Oh, and ho homes are upgrading. Excellent. We'll build another marketplace over here, then. So let's place a bakery nearby, and there should be a well over here somewhere. Uh, wow, homes are upgrading like crazy. This is it. We broke through. Right. I don't see a well around here. So I'm just going to ask for one to be built. And then we can build a marketplace maybe right here next to the tower. As soon as things are looking a little bit better. Alright, and make sure I hired people there. Alright, let's take a look at the massive unemployment. That's certainly a problem. Oh, actually, not really. Not, not as many people unemployed as I was predicting. Okay. Uh, we have 11 days left to provide the bread. Seems like a lot of it is going directly to the uh, to the people to eat. Oh wow, Taylor's workshop is done. Good. Only one of those. I'm really surprised it only takes one person to work there. Wow, we went from like rags to riches in one episode, everybody. We were just, just dragging along the dirt with the amount of uh, food that we didn't have. And the amount of money we didn't have now, we're max almost maxing out. Lots of clothing left, lots of bread, lots of uh, berries. Let's complete this goal, too. I want to see this one get done for uh, delivering to the clergy. just want to see if we can get more delivered. 
Eight days remaining. Still a lot of supply. It takes a while to make a building. But we got our bakeries down and then some. So let's make sure we can complete this goal. More people into town. Look at this. All these buildings are upgraded. The homes are actually upgraded now. Look at how cool that is. That is epic, man. So cool. Very, very cool. Super cool. Down below in that comment section. And I will heart your comment, everybody. Thank you very much for all the support. And all the love and all the encouragement. That's really what helps the city to grow. That's the nutrients we all feed off of is that positive feedback. But we've done really well. Very, very well. All right, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of these two people selling uh, bread. Actually, I think this person was selling... I think this person actually was selling goods. So let's hire Catherine back. Let's get rid of the uh, two... Wow, two Catherines are working here. All right, perfect. We can now sell the bread. Excellent. Objectives complete. Perfect. We had a little slowdown in the bread production. Now it's good. Excellent. Everything has been completed here. Finally, the two bakeries are down and up and running. We got a third one on its way. Money is starting to pile in. And we got a lot more things to unlock here in Foundation. If you're excited for the next episode and want to see it tomorrow, show your wonderful support. And I will be back. And I will see you soon. Thank you, everybody, for cheering me on. And I will see you next time for more of Raptoria's story here in Foundation. Goodbye, everybody.